to Foxy TV. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today. So I have some incredible people here that I'm hanging out with today at the one, the only Studio One, and I got some amazing staff with me. So I'll let everyone introduce themselves. We got the engineers on this side, so let's go ahead and start on this side. What's going on? My name is Joseph J. Osasani. I follow J. O. Music, lead engineer, and producer over here at Studio One. I'm Joey B. I'm one of the lead producers and engineers also. How you doing? Welcome to Studio One. My name is Jose, CEO of Studio One. Welcome to the future of entertainment. And my name is Tammy Sandoval, also known as the Studio One Queen, office manager. And my name is Raymond Washington. I'm assistant engineer here at Studio One. I'm Michael Santos, one of the new inter interns here. Look me up, follow me on Instagram, official underscore infamous. I'm Cassie Price. I'm also one of the interns here. All right, so shout out to the staff. We got the president, we got the interns, <laughs> office manager. Everybody's in the building today. I like this. Yeah. <laughs> right? All right, so well, let's start with you, Mr. President. Sure. So how did Studio One come about? Well, uh, this is a great place for a new artist to have the opportunity to be exposed to, uh, you know, the entertainment industry. Uh, we have a lot of producers here, so pick and choose. Uh, not every producer is made for every artist, but we have the advantage of uh, pick and choose. So yeah, that's the good thing about entertainment. It's not the same, but it's a hell of a ride. <laughs> Enjoy it. <laughs> okay, I like that. So speaking of the producers, what are some of the different tunes or the vibes that you guys have since it's different uh, genres of music? I think we can do a little bit of everything. We have a lot of classy stuff. We have a lot of uh, you know mainstream stuff, pop stuff. You know, we do everything from uh, readings and people doing like you know the talking to books to gospel music and everything in between so the a lot of voiceover stuff from production to post-production music composition we pretty much go the whole distance here okay yeah. okay i like that so being a studio and how long have you been here how long has studio one been here? Uh, uh late 2002 uh, and it's every year it's uh it's an advantage we get to meet a lot of new people um new staff new people that move on to bigger better things still part of the family mm -hmm. but this is a place where people take that step to better the career. Okay, I like that. And new artists are welcome, which I really like. Yes. Um, so for staff, anyone can answer, what's been a favorite moment or maybe a most memorable moment of being here and working here in the studio? You know what? Most of the story is here. I don't think. But uh, you know what? Tammy's, Tammy will be able to tell a good story there. there you go. <laughs> a very memorable day extremely long day. We worked on a documentary for a Lazy Bone. Uh, a 14 hour day, um, very exhausting. Um, a lot of amazing things went on, which is usually how it happens. Smoke, we're tired, we're exhausted, <laughs> um, but by the end of the day, we're lucky, excited, blessed to look back on everything that happened and to know that we were actually a part of something so amazing. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, you guys are definitely, you're a part of careers, and I'm sure you're able to see them transform and transition. Okay. It's an honor. The, transition. That's the beauty Absolutely. of it, yeah, correct. Mm -hmm. To see them from a uh, rough, to actually master their craft. It's a beautiful thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So just kind of like sitting back in the, the studio when you guys are doing your thing, what are some maybe challenges that you've observed that you see that artists go through or experience? Well, producers will be able to answer that. Yeah, <laughs> you're there. They're always going, cut, do it again, do it again. And then I see it, I go, well, that's, that's, that's 40 yeah. times. No, let me get it right. Yeah. No, that's a really good question because uh, I think this place is really big on artist development. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we, we focus very heavily on taking people that, you know, are maybe just kind of getting serious into it and then like transforming them into like a star or monster, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, but I think like, you know, the, the main thing people um, probably struggle with the most is, is just uh, kind of uh, deciphering who is really doing the business and, and who is kind of shady and, you know, not, not really uh, everything they say they are maybe. Mm -hmm. I think that's probably the, the artist part for versus artists. the uh, yeah. the business is completely yeah, different. Exactly. Yes, that's the hardest <laughs> part for artists is to actually decide like who's who's really saying and who's actually doing. Yeah. You know, there's but, a lot of personal attention that we do here, and especially with the artist development that he's touching on. I mean, a lot of times some of these artists are good to go; they know what they want. Yeah. Other times, you know, we're getting kids in here who are just still in high school. I mean, we've yeah. been working with a lot of youth inside of here. We're working yeah. with a lot of different people with different backgrounds. Yeah. And the one thing that we all know is that these are people at the end of the day, and everybody's got a path that they're going to lead and follow, and there is a formula to the business. So yeah. at the end of the day, we just kind of help them get there. Yeah, I love that formula, artist yeah. development. That's amazing. That's 
great. Stepping stones here. Yeah, That's what it's all about. Mm -hmm. So from my interns, what has been a favorite part or something most memorable about being in the studio? Um, for me, it would be the Lazy Bone session mm -hmm. showed up. Um, <laughs> bone, bone, it, was bone, my, bone. it was my second week interning, and then mm -hmm. they said they were telling me, oh, yeah, Lazy comes here, and I'm like, oh, I'll probably won't meet him for like a while. And he came <laughs> up two weeks later, and we worked You're two like, days, I'm glad I took this days, internship. <laughs> yeah, two days, worked on a music video, and really good, yeah, mm -hmm. really good experience. Mm -hmm. So, do you guys have goals? What's your goals? Do you want to be engineers, producers? Actually, yeah, I want to be an engineer, most definitely. I'm only, I've only been here for about a month and a half now. I love the environment, mm -hmm. and hopefully, to work my way up and be an engineer, hopefully, pretty soon. So. Okay. Okay. I'm still trying to find where I fit into the whole music scene. I love everything about music. Mm -hmm. So, I have long term goals, which is to have my own label and my own recording studio. And here, I get to learn everything. So I, I just watch, I observe, and they, they teach me what they know. So yeah. it's a great learning experience, and yeah. it's great to see the artists be so happy when they're in the studio just recording, doing what they love to do. Mm -hmm. so. mm -hmm. And I love something you touched on, which I think is a great thing no matter what industry you're in, when you have to learn a little bit of everything. Yeah. I think you're just, when you are across the board talented, you know engineering, you know producing, you know writing. Mm -hmm. I mean, that that's some sick talent right there, sure. you know, to be yeah. cross-trained in so many different things. So. I really like that. So, okay, talk about social media, website, how can people find the studio? How can they find, like, how to book a session? Sure, um, we have a website, it's uh, studio1-inc.com. Uh, everything that we do goes through the website, and of course social media, anything that's got Studio One Inc. is also there, our hashtag is Studio One Inc. We try to keep it simple to the point. Uh, we are Studio One Inc., we are the official how, uh, home of Harmony House Entertainment. Of course, our label is FAM. Uh, we also not just do music. Uh, what people hear in two and a half minutes, it might take about a month. Wow. And that's the good thing about what we do here. We have all that uh, behind the scenes people that are responsible for what's happening, which in a lot of cases, they don't take uh, um, you know, the spotlight sometimes. So yeah, it's a great opportunity. And thank you. I'd like to appreciate Say thank you for having us on your show. Yes. Yeah, that's so true. The, the behind the scenes people definitely need love and there you go. <laughs> they're the Those are my guys. Thank really you. keep it up together. Yeah, correct. So studio one. All yes, the correct. craziness or stayed up till what, two o'clock, three o'clock in the morning to get something done? Yes. So definitely that's shout correct. out to the behind the scenes people. That's correct. Uh -huh. So a few, a few studios here in Corona, yeah. Yeah. San Bernardino, Los Angeles, mm -hmm. you know, this area that we take care of is in an in an empire. Yeah, shout out to the Inland Empire. The wow. IE is doing it. <laughs> <laughs> so I know everybody's probably working on like your individual stuff too. So I just want to get your social media. Go ahead, shout it out. If you have Instagram, Facebook, website, how can people find you individually also? Sure. Follow J.O. Music. Go ahead and check out my new singles, Panic. I can't wait. Available now on iTunes, Spotify, all that good stuff. Uh, just Google straight up. Follow J.O. Music. <laughs> <laughs> um, our website is listen to fam.com. That's the uh, independent label that we push everything through. Uh, got a lot of great artists. You can check out Key Soprano. Um, you know, he's one of our leads. He's really incredible. We got a lot of stuff on iTunes. You can just look under uh, FAM, Lobster Zinc, um, Key Soprano. Uh, I think my Twitter is Who is Giuseppe. So that's that pretty much everything. Yeah, on the studio here, it was basic uh, the hashtag Studio One Inc., uh, Facebook, Instagram, uh, Twitter. We all over the place. So yeah, it's kind of a, a cool thing. The advantage of the power of the internet. Yeah. <laughs> we out there. That's the best thing to see is all over the place. Love it. On Facebook, I can be found under Tammy Sandoval. And Instagram, I am studio number one queen. <laughs> OK, studio queen. <laughs> my, my Instagram is uh, at Foolish Contender. Look out for the Black Sheep. Um, it's a project I'm working on with a new artist called Pax. So look out for that. It's coming soon. Follow me on Instagram, official one for me. It's got a new EP dropping called Against All Laws coming real soon. Um, follow my label page, MDM Music, on, on Instagram as well. You can find me on Facebook and Instagram, Cassie Price. Yeah. Okay. If you guys didn't know, now you know. Studio One is doing big things in the IE, so you need to get down here. <laughs> it's a lot going on there, doing some incredible things, so make sure you check them out. Hey, don't forget to join us on social media, Foxy TV. You can also find us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And if you haven't already, be sure you hit that subscribe button below and subscribe to our channel. I can't wait to see you guys again, but in the meantime, I'm going to be kicking it with these amazing people here at Studio One and Corona. I'll be back, Shannon Fox, Foxy TV. Peace. Peace. Oh,